I woke up this morning with a face full of hives. You can't see it all clearly in the video, but trust me, I can feel it. It's all over the areas I'm pointing out, really heavy around the sides of my nose, the sides of my face, and my forehead, and a little bit on my neck. So unfortunately, I have no idea what caused me to break out in hives. They actually started to pop up last night, and when I woke up this morning, they were just everywhere, and you can still see some redness here and redness here, and I can still feel the bumps, and I still feel the itchiness underneath. Hopefully, they're making their way through my system. You can see I'm makeup free today because I was not going to be putting any makeup on this and irritating it more. But I didn't want to not put anything on because my skin is really dry. So I reached for this guy right here, my Snail Mucin by CauseRx. I had some skin irritation from something before and it didn't irritate it. So I figured that was my safest bet. I did wash my face. I put some cortisone cream on last night and I needed to get that off my face. And I need to put something over that because my face was really, really tight. I've had some people ask from my previous video about it, where does it go in your step of skincare? And the way I use it is, you've gotta put it on damp skin. So I put it on after I put my toner on while the toner is still damp, about 75, 80% dry, but my skin is still damp. I put this on, I let it fully soak in, and the really great thing about it is it's very thick, but it absorbs very, very quickly. So it's not like you have to sit there and wait for like 10 minutes, 15 minutes. It absorbs within a minute or two, and then I do the rest of my skincare. So for me in the morning, that would be my vitamin C serum, and then my eye cream and moisturizer, and at night, I put it on and let it completely, completely dry before I put on my retinol. And then after my retinol, once that dries, I put on my eye cream and moisturizer. I hope that helps for those of you who have asked. And let's hope these hives are gone by tomorrow.